hey guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much for joining me any new subscribers that i have really appreciate you coming to my channel and joining us um i haven't been on here much and i do apologize i have a lot going on for the new year um the new year did not start off all great fine and perfect and roses like everybody else's i guess so i've been going through a lot and i just have not had the energy or the emotional strength to just come on youtube so that's why you haven't had any faces of the days i mean the new year we're weekend and i'm just now bringing you a face of the day so just keep your girl lifted up i'm just doing a lot and i just you know i'm even contemplating like just chilling on youtube for a minute so just keep me lifted up hopefully i can get through everything and get back to you know my regular self i just don't feel like myself so i'm going to come to you really quick with the face of the day and as it says in the title, it is featuring this brush. Okay. And let me see what they call the name of this one is. I think this is like the Artiste. Is it called Artiste or something brush? Um, mine is off of eBay. Mine is called the Curve Foundation Pro Oval Brush. In case you're looking for it, if you want the link to the seller, I'll put it down below. This was $1.68. $1.68 with free shipping a dollar 68 with free shipping it is did come from overseas so it took me like three weeks to get it did take three weeks to get um i used it for my foundation this morning i don't prefer this brush for your foundation because i feel like when i'm trying to blend in my foundation that i could possibly break it it um kind of feels a little wobbly a little weak so i got nervous and i went on to use my regular brush for my foundation but i did find something that i could use this for if you want it like me just because it's cute just because it's in the makeup community and just because we just got to have it <clears throat> you can get it what i did use it for was my under eye concealer i put my concealer under my eye and i went under my eye with this brush and i smoothed it out and i did like it for that i also liked it for my contour if you use a cream contour, I don't use a cream contour, but I use like um, the LA Pro Girl concealers for my contour. So it's not really a cream contour, but it is like a liquid foundation contour. And you can use it for that and it will just blend it in. What I do like about it is, and forgive me for it being dirty, but I did use it this morning and yesterday. Um, it's very, it's not very soft. It's very, I guess to a dense level where it's actually going to blend in your foundation it's going to blend it in it's not so soft to where it's not going to get your stuff blended in um i did see a picture from someone on instagram um the other day where theirs had broke so it kind of had me paranoid because you just want to hold it right here and do your foundation and doing that it feels like you're going to break it so i stopped doing that immediately and um so i like this brush I think it was well worth the dollar sixty-eight. Would I pay forty, fifty, sixty, seventy dollars for it? No. Um, it was worth the dollar sixty-eight. It's worth to have in your collection. Order three of them, however many you want to have them in your collection. And it is really, really good. I would say for under eye, for doing your contour, maybe for going above the eye and smoothing out your eye, your uh, eyebrow contour highlight. So. This is a good brush. This was good for $1.68. I don't have any regrets on spending $1.68. There's no name on this brush. Um, like I said, there was no name on uh, eBay. It's just the Foundation Tool Pro Oval Brush. And it looks like that. Very full, very full bristles. Very nice. So we'll see how it cleans and everything. This was my first week using it. Um, on my face, I'm using the items for my uh, Make Shop My Stash. Um, I didn't do eyeshadow today. It's Friday. It's dress down day at work. I just did not do eyeshadow. And if you follow me on Instagram, on my lips, I have on Peanut Brittle. These are the new NYX Intense Butter Glosses. Yesterday, I put a picture on Instagram of this one, which is Cookie Butter. And today, I have on Peanut Brittle by itself, just so you can see. And this is not even doing it justice. These are just as pigmented. You know what they remind me of? If you can't get Nana Cocoa, look at that by itself if you can't get a hold of the nana cocoa glosses that we all love so 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 very much these remind me of that i actually went back um i purchased cookie butter first just on a whim to see how it was gonna do and then i actually went back on my lunch yesterday and grabbed another cookie butter and peanut brittle 
And these are the only two nudes in the collections. Now, for my ladies who like reds and burgundies and vampy looks, yes, they have them. And they also have uh, pink and one called cotton candy or unicorn. Very, very pretty, pretty hot pink and a pretty pink. So they do have these. You can use your $350 off $10. You can get two of them and use your $350 off $10 coupon. They are very pigmented. They are worth every bit of the money. Now, I got mine from Ulta, but I'm pretty sure they're available on the NYX website, the Ulta website. Um, Target and the beauty supply stores do carry these, but they don't have the new ones. I checked. The new ones are at Ulta or online, okay? Maybe they'll make it to Target and the beauty supply stores really soon. Target, my Target, check your Target, has marked down all of their NYX products. So to me, they're getting ready for the new ones. So if you want any of the old NYX products that we had or you have a favorite that you're looking for, Target has NYX on clearance. Check it out. All right, you guys, I've held you long enough. I hope you enjoyed this face of the day, and I'll see you guys next time.